Hey, it's Matt from Tradesman Digital Marketing. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through Google Ads device targeting. I'm going to go over what it is, uh, the benefits of using device targeting, and essentially how to adjust it inside your campaign for your own benefit. Now, first off, what is device targeting inside Google Ads? And simply put, device targeting is the ability to target certain devices inside Google Ads that you want your ads to show for. So in a general search campaign that we normally recommend to most of the service-based businesses we manage, uh, you're able to target computers, mobile phones, and tablets. If you're running a display campaign or video campaign, you're also included the option of TV screens. Now inside Google ads, you can actually adjust the bid limit. So if you want to completely get rid of a certain device, so say you only want phone calls, you could completely kill off computers and tablets, set a hundred percent bid decrease, and you won't target them anymore. You could also do this for computers if you only wanted lead forms. Uh, really the choices for you are endless when it comes to targeting certain devices. You can also set it for a certain bid decrease or bid increase, so maybe five or 10% if you want both devices to be on par when it comes to cost per lead, which is something very useful if you're getting leads from multiple devices and you can really mitigate and really optimize your account, which is really nice. So how do we go about changing device targeting inside our Google Ads account? And the first thing we have to do is click on the campaign we want to change our device target in. So we're gonna click on our call only campaign here. We're gonna come down here to show more, and then we're gonna click on devices down here. And now if you're running a general search campaign, these three options will pop up and they should be set to zero. So I'll set them back to zero here. Um, but really you can adjust this for whatever you want. So say we only wanted phone calls. The, generally the best way to go about that is setting computers and tablets at a decrease of a 100% bid adjustment. So you can just go in here, set it at 100%. All you have to do is click on the little pencil icon here and it will change your bid adjustment. And that's fairly easy to do. I would set that as well for computers. Now, if you only wanted lead forms, generally the reverse is recommended. So you would set mobile phones and tablets to decrease at 100% and then let computers, I would generally set whatever device we're targeting. So if we wanted phone calls, I would generally set mobile phones at an increased bid adjustment of 5%. But if we're only targeting computers for lead forms, uh, I would probably set that at a five or 10% bid adjustment, just to signal to Google that we do indeed want to target this device. And we want to bid a little bit more than our competition for them because those leads are very valuable to us. Now, if you don't have a super segmented campaign and you're okay with leads coming from any device, you don't really care if it's a phone call or a lead form or whatever it is. My general recommendation is to gather as much data as you can. Generally a month or two, you're able to come in here and really look at what device is performing best and which devices aren't performing as well. And say we see that mobile phones are performing really well. What we can do is up this, we'll go, okay, uh, Right now we're getting a cost per lead of let's say $30. We're fine uh, paying upwards to $50. We can actually increase our bid adjustment to 10% saying we're willing to bid more on these leads, just get us as many as possible. And that's what's gonna happen with the bid adjustment. We're going to be willing to pay more because our cost per lead is so low and we want more of those leads. Now say computer leads are really expensive and they're $65. What we can do is come in here to bid adjustment and decrease it by five or 10%. Generally, I like to recommend 5% to start off with. Uh, and then if it still doesn't really bring the number down, you could decrease it to 10% and then maybe 15%. But anything more than that initially, you're going to really change the actual dynamic and you might not see any more clicks coming out of that device just because you're bidding so low on the auction house. So keep that in mind when you're adjusting bid limits, do it very incrementally. Don't do it all at once down to like, you know, minus 20%. Uh, you're just going to see massive changes. And in my opinion, that's too much of a change to really go about making effective decision inside your account. But those are the two ways I generally go about device targeting. If we only want leads from one device, I would say change the other two devices to negative 100%. That will completely cut traffic from all those devices and you'll only get it from one devices. So you could set it mobile phones or computers, whichever one you want. But if you're getting leads from every single device, you can look at each device, see which ones need to be slightly decreased and see which ones need to be slightly increased. So it's up to you. But that's device targeting in a nutshell. If you have any comments, questions or concerns about it, leave it down in the comment section down below. I'd be happy to answer them. Other than that, you guys have a great day and take care.